that's real good. Hi, this is Janet from Manhattan Edit Workshop. And today I would like to show you how to match frame in Final Cut Pro. After I've edited a clip into the timeline, and I would like to see the unused portion of the clip. For example, I have this shot here in my timeline that ends right as this man is sipping his coffee. I would like to see the rest of this shot to see what else I have on this clip. This is a perfect example of when I might use match frame. I'm going to place my playhead somewhere on the clip and simply press the shift F key. You'll notice in my browser, the clip that I'm working with appears. We see that the clip currently has in and out marks. Those are defining the section that I'm currently using in my timeline. Also notice that the playhead is lining up exactly where my playhead is positioned in my timeline. That's where the word match frame comes from. It's matching the playhead in the timeline and showing you where that is in the, in the source clip. So I can see this is the part of the clip that I'm using. If I scrub beyond the out point, I can see the rest of the clip. And if I would like to use additional parts of the shot, I can go ahead and mark in and out and edit that into my timeline. So to recap, match frame is actually super easy. Place the playhead over the clip you would like to match. Press Shift F and the shot will be highlighted in the event browser. This is Janet. Thanks for watching. And for more information on learning Final Cut Pro and taking classes, please visit muShop.com.